Hey, and welcome to Home Reviews. In this video, we're looking at this Air Choice Infrared Heater. You can see the model number there, and I'll put the link below the video too if you wanna go check it out yourself. This model does come with a remote control. Um, it does not have the batteries in it. It takes two AAA batteries that you gotta put in it. But what I'm gonna do is, I just got this out of the box. I haven't plugged it up yet or anything, so we're gonna look this over. We're gonna plug it up and we're gonna see if this thing really does put out much heat or not. So uh, I just wanna look at this first and um, you got a little sticker here that says do not cover. But what I noticed was when I took it out, and I know this isn't the fault of the manufacturing company, uh, but you can see the corner of it here is a little bit busted in, but that's probably due to the shipping company here cause they are not very easy when they handle packages. Anyways, um, on the back here is where you have your cord and you can wind it up, it looks like, on these two little brackets here. And then down here you have your power button. And then you have your controller also to use it to power on and off. Control your temperature up and down, change mode, set a timer, and switch between Celsius and Fahrenheit. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this unwound here and we're gonna plug it up. Okay, so we got it plugged up. I just flipped the switch in the back to power it on. You can see we got a power button here now. So let's grab the remote. And let's go ahead and see what we can do here. First of all, let's click the power button. And that turns it on. And right off, I can feel quite a bit of air blowing out of there. And it's already, this thing heats up really, really fast. And I can feel it already. And so you got settings down here. All this is touch control. So you can just touch the screen if you want to, to adjust where you want the temperature set at. Um, this is getting very warm though. This is getting much warmer than I expected that it would and I can I can feel it back here where I'm standing very easy. Um, but down here on the remote you see you have uh, your temperature up. It's already all the way up at 86 so temperature down is going to turn it down and adjust it for that. Now you also have this option here. This is your mode button and you can see it here on your remote too. And right now it's on high, which means it's consuming 1500 watts, but it's also putting out a lot of heat. And if we hit mode again, it's going to turn it down to low where I believe it says that it consumes um, 750 watts in the manual. Let me jump over here and check real quick. Uh, you can see right here, 750 watts. And then on eco mode, it says the heater will manage itself from less to more heating power in an attempt to maintain a constant warmth of 68 degrees. And so you can turn it on economy mode. It automatically adjusts to 68 where it tries to keep that temperature. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this back up to high again. You can see where it kicked off and turned down cause it went to 68. But now you also have an option for a timer, which is right here. And so if you were to hit timer, you're gonna see this temperature is gonna change. And if you hit it again, it sets it at one, two, and these are by hour long increments. So if we leave it on two, that means it's gonna run for two hours and then shut off. And so it goes all the way up to 12 hours. And this is actually um, feeling very hot on my hand right here, this far away from it. And then you have on here where you can adjust the Celsius and Fahrenheit. But that's all there is to it. So super easy to use and uh, it definitely, definitely works. It puts out heat. Um, I'm very impressed with this. I was not expecting it to put out this much heat at all. So for a, a smaller sized room, a bedroom, a bathroom, even a small living room to help kind of keep a constant temperature uh, or even to heat it up depending on how cold it is outside or in your home, uh, this may be for you. So what I'll do is I'll put that link below this video. You guys can go there and check it out yourself and uh, get you some heat wherever you need it. That's it for this video. If you guys enjoy these types of reviews, be sure to subscribe and I'll let you know when I put out my next video. Thanks.